another GCSE economics video presented by Mr. Goff at mrgoff.com. Today's video will be about opportunity cost. Opportunity cost is the next best alternative given up when making an economic choice. Sounds simple enough. Let's have a look at one of the common mistakes that students tend to make. Students often forget to make reference to a scarce resource. They might say something like, if I buy a drink and I don't buy a chocolate, the chocolate is the opportunity cost. It's not as simple as this. However, if you say, if I would like both, but only have enough money for either a drink or a chocolate, then if I buy the drink, the chocolate is the opportunity cost and vice versa, now you're making a correct statement because you have linked it to the scarce resource you had of only enough money to buy one or the other. Even the choice of spending or not spending can be seen to have an opportunity cost. When we save our money, we earn interest on the money that we've saved. The opportunity cost of earning interest on this money is not being able to save it and have the goods and services now. Conversely, the opportunity cost of spending is not being able to have our money earning interest and be able to spend it later. So far, we've talked about the opportunity cost of financial decisions, but it doesn't always have to be about money. We can have an opportunity cost wherever any scarce resource is involved. Consider a worker that is given the opportunity for promotion. This may come with higher pay, but the opportunity cost of this is having to work longer hours and having less time to spend with their family. The opportunity cost of bad behaviour at school is suffering the sanctions that are associated with it. As you get older, you may find that there are more sports that you enjoy playing than you have time to play. Some of them might turn out to be on at the same time. The opportunity cost of taking part in one is not being able to take part in the other. So far, we've been focused on the opportunity costs faced by individuals, but firms make economic choices every day. In order to be successful, businesses need to be efficient in their use of resources like savings, profit, labour and capital. A bakery that chooses to specialise in cakes faces the opportunity cost of no longer being able to make money from selling other baked goods. Businesses regularly have more opportunities than they can afford to take advantage of. Therefore, they have to weigh these up and decide which is the best one to take. A business that could decide between investing in improving its capital equipment or opening another outlet, but can only afford one, will find that the opportunity cost of doing one of these things is not being able to do the other. The government also faces opportunity costs with all of its decisions. Each year the government sets a budget. They could be tempted to set a budget deficit every year to give them more money to spend so that they can boost the economy. However, there is an opportunity cost to this of higher debt repayments and less to spend in later years. Once the total budget is established, if the government chooses to spend more in one area, say education, then that money has to come from another area of spending or else increase the deficit. OK, that's all we've got time for today. But don't worry too much if opportunity cost is still confusing you. It'll come up within all the other topics that we cover as you go through the course. So it's bye for now, and I'll hope to see you again for another GCSE economics video here at mrgoff.com.